On the popular video site YouTube, there exist countless videos called Let's Play, where socially maladjusted individuals talk over footage of themselves playing video games for money. Somewhere in Ohio, one such Let's Player and his wife decided to continue the practice with varying degrees of success on a licensed game for a TV series way outside the typical demographic for this type of video. These are their stories. I knew Gondafor was hiding something. We have no physical evidence tying Gondafor to any of the murders. Yeah, we've convicted on less. Let's go for it. Involved somehow, I'd love to nail him, but we don't have nearly enough for a warrant. Find a connection between him and Jackson. Bye, but that's the best I can do. Oh, come on! Come on! Don't look at her like. Patty Sewell officer was able to get us his employment file and several other records from the landscaping company. Hmm. You think Gondafor was one of Jackson's customers? The landscaper he worked for had clients all over Long Island. It's possible. Patty Jackson was a call from his work to David Gondafor on October 20th. The same day Gondafor paid two. Oh no, Gondafor has. Alright, we got our evidence. Let's go convict. Like we found our paper trail. Let's convict this convict. We have a warrant to search the wow, no even for evidence no scene transition? of the murders of Ben no Cohen and Angelica Moore. Anyway, oh, yeah? Please. Try it. Shall I have some iced tea made? Actually, we'll start with the garden shed, if you don't mind. Oh, man, not well, another one. You were in the shed, Mr. Gondafor. I, I suppose I am in and out quite often. I like to do some of my own gardening. It, uh, it relaxes me. Mr. Jackson hmm. and I have become fast friends as a result. He is quite talented. I'll keep an eye on Gondafor while you have a look. Just gonna stare at him threateningly. <laughs> All right, another crime scene to look to. Let's see what we can do. If we can do any better this time, see if we can stay above zero. Okay. Gotta be deliberate. So we got a bloody tool, more duct tape, deodorizer, okay, burlap sack, shovel, and more zip ties in a sideways plastic container this time. There's that. Bloody tool. All right. Right back. Ding! All right. There's a burlap sack right there, hiding. It's like the same kind too. Yep. Right there and there. More burlap sacks of oxygen. Same kind too. And it's, it has one on top to make it seem uh, inconspicuous, you know. Right. Come on, your shit! Ooh, so bitch. Okay, go the other way now. That wouldn't be. No. Okay. Well, if we don't see any I want to look else. around first before you start. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's see. What else are we looking for? Duct tape, shovel, zip ties, and the other Okay. Good. We'll go back to the tools, see if there's a shovel. A spade, but probably not the shovel we're no, looking for, because yeah. the shovel's, like, big right. looking one. Go down. And that's a hoe, and that's a mallet. Okay. Yeah, no shovel here. Okay, go over. The deodorizer is gonna give you problems. Well, it'll probably be like pop right out. Aha! Uh -huh. Duct tape. Yep. More duct tape. Same as the guy we found in Patty's van. Oh, dang! Alright. Moving on. Zip ties! And shut up. Zip ties. Oh, that worked. Same brand, same color as we found in Patty's van. Forensic may even be able to tell if they're from the same store bought cops. Oh, yeah, we got your shit now! Shovel. And the shovel. No surprise to find a shovel here. But if any of the dirt found on it matches the soil in which the main dirt. That's where you grab the shovel and start swinging at them. Powerful physical evidence to convince a jury. Alright. Deodorizer. It's deodorizer. I got four chances to find this mystery let's, deodorizer. Uh, let's be careful about this now. Alright, let's see. Mm. Oh, no, I'm also like. I feel like we haven't done anything up here yet. It's got to be a bottle that sticks out, because... I know, it's kind of like that one. These all look the... No, this all looks the same, though. We got, I know, but that one sticks out. But what's back here, though? Aha. Uh -huh. That's a, That's right. I didn't see that. Air freshener. I've seen a pattern. What doesn't match? Because everything else looks the same. We'll be able to tell me if it's a match. All right. We stayed above, above zero. We, we did it. I think we had three left. Yeah. Woohoo! You have the evidence! Well, we just got a whole bunch of evidence right here. And shit. 
All right, time for the order. Mr. Gondapur, where is your counsel? I choose to represent myself in this matter, Your Honor. Okay, Mr. Arab. I'm not Arab! I to hire a whole team of lawyers experienced in defending clients charged with capital crimes. Actually, Your Honor, <laughs> my alleged co-conspirator and I wish to be tried together. Together? Your Honor. Your Honor, we cannot have one defendant putting another on the stand. Mr. Gondapur, are you... Yeah, is that, is that legal? I don't think it is. I don't think that's legal. Your ability to adequately cross-examine and communicate your side of the story efficiently and effectively? We are, Your Honor. Then I see no problem... <laughs> Bullshit. Deny. What? How do you plead? Not guilty, Your Honor. Of course. Huh? What? Sorry, I'm on meth. Uh, not guilty? Well done, Mr. Jackson. The rest of you will see you at trial. Fuck! Your team of lawyers is only as strong as your weakest lawyer. We're gonna hit that motherfucking patty guy hard! They'll each point the finger at each other and create enough reasonable doubt, and both of them will walk. Both of them? <laughs> Come on, Jack, why you gotta be a, such a downer all the time? Yeah, but Gandivore is a shark. His he eyes are always, like, in permanent hate mode. Well, in a big DA, you have to hate every criminal, and you gotta be full Those of hate. eyebrows. A sex offender on parole, accused of murdering eight women. Some, uh, some people use, like, an eyebrow pencil to draw their eyebrows on. Jack McCoy uses Sharpies. The really thick ones, too. <laughs> yeah, divide and conquer, which means... Go after the weakest guy. Patty is going to make their defense shatter. Alright. Sworn on, let's take this guy out. Hmm. Alright. What should we ask first? Let's see. Alright. Let's talk about relationships. That'd be a good place to start, I think. Mm, yeah. What makes you think Patty Jackson and David Gandapur are co-conspirators in the deaths of these women? Yeah, go, good starting point. Physical evidence? I believe Jackson worked for Gandapur. Yeah. How sure. He was I believe they were almost called a dominant submissive parent. <laughs> <laughs> As partners, they were able to fulfill each other's appetites. Jackson for sexual abuse. Okay. Gandapur for murder. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can see it. <laughs> should I stop looking for theorizing? Yeah. I think I should. Fuck! <laughs> Alright, fine. Trophies. Uh, I don't know. The hair that. and shit. Well, the hair never came up in, in evidence. That's just gonna be conjecture, pretty much. Let's talk about the victim's body. Most of the Mangler's victims were found in shallow graves around Nassau County. But Wendy Crane was found in Harlem. Mm -hmm. in mm -hmm. Can you explain? Mm -hmm. Patty didn't follow the plan. Aha! You see, Wendy had defensive wounds on her hands and on her arms. Something went wrong in the van. Oh, she fought. And strangled her. Then got swooped and tried to dump the body right there. Yeah. Is he mistaken about the body? No, he's not. Yes! <gasps> Don't fuck it up! What is one other important detail? The lock of hair taken from Wendy. Yes! I believe those trophies to be extremely important to him. Alright, he but specifically Jeff mentioned trophies. Idiot. Alright, let's talk about trophies, seeing as how he managed to emphasize trophies there in, right. his, in his testimony. What caused you to think of Mr. Jackson when you became involved in the hunt for the Massapequa Mangler? When I found out a yeah, lot a cute of Wendy Crane's hair was missing. Is this relevant? Yes, yes it is! Yeah! I don't think, like, the things we ask go along with the timeline of the yeah, previous yeah, thing that we not asked. Always. So, Logan simply guess. That is a guess. Yes, taking yeah. hair was Perry Jackson's mm, malevolent octopus. That was correct. <laughs> You're ridiculous. Alright, Teresa, my son, bitch! Objection! 
I'm not a pervert. What? Mr. Jackson is a convicted rapist. Yeah, he's a pervert. <laughs> uh, he is a pervert, Your Honor. We have records of proving this. <laughs> Overruled. Defendant is a pervert. <laughs> Yay, we're ahead! Woo. We're doing it! We're doing it! The jury likes us a little bit. Yeah. Mr. Logan, detective. Alright. Oh, yeah. First of all, you argumentative. That's talking with the witness or being. You expect us to believe this? Alright. Alright. You know, I'm gonna write these down because I always seem to forget. So. I'm pretty sure the cat is eating my hair. Is he really? My god. Give me pet. Oh, I thought he was. Okay. Argument, fucking ask, answer, uh, question, next to, I hope I can read this, hearsay, sorry, 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 uh, uh, other testimony, and then badgering. We should know what badgering is. Is insult. Okay, alright, alright, okay, let's, let's do this. I think you got a nice fat promotion when I got pinched, didn't you? That's not the way it works. Mm -hmm. You put the blame on me because you couldn't mm -hmm. solve your case and you thought you were going to get fired. Uh, I would like to object. He's starting to badger him. He's starting to motherfucking badger him. He's like, yeah, you can get your fuck, Jack. Yeah, yeah, you shit lawyer, you. Calm down. Yeah. Would you like to object to that one? Uh, Do you even know what he asked? Uh, Objection, Your Honor. I think he was being argumentative. Argumentative objection overruled. Fuck! See? I would like to continue. Yes, please, please, please. Keep it on point, Mr. Donald. Damn it. Alright, pay attention. I am most curious, Detective Lee. How did you form your opinion on how my landscaper and I collaborated in the murders of these women? Mm -hmm. I've been a detective for over 25 years, mostly in homicide. Are you a psychologist? No. Criminal profiler. Any professional uh, psychology of serial killers? No. Hey, hey, hey. Objection, Your Honor. Asked and answered. The question has been asked and answered. Overruled. Damn it! What? Ah! That's what he's fucking doing, though! All my co-defendants are guilty of such ghastly crimes uh. as the so-called Massapequa Mangler. Burlap fibers found in Wendy Crane's hair match that found in Patty Jackson's van and in your garden shed. Right. The most telling was a cutting tool we found in the same shed with uh -huh. Crane's blood on. There was also duct tape and zip ties. Evidence, evidence, evidence. And the shed that were an exact match for ones found on other victims. Anything in my home? Not that I'm aware. Your shed is your home. We found evidence in Mr. Jackson's van. Evidence in my garden. In my garden shed, which I own in my house. That's right. None of my Was that? No. You're no. very careful in that regard. Just Fuck. One more question. Why are you skipping shit? I thought if I had to click to object. I made twenty-five million dollars last year alone in salary and bonuses. What does that have to do with anything? Yeah. Do I sound like the type of person who does his own gardening? Uh Objection, Your Honor. That's argumentative. Argumentative to say yeah. I object to. What is this? Some kind of Marx Brothers routine? <laughs> 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 Sit down, you Right? No further questions. Objection, incompetence. Fuck. Way to go. Well, we can always get it back with our closing arguments. That's what always loops it around. We've come to make you an offer. Mr. They're all they're already offering? I think you'll find quite generous given the circumstances. What if Mr. Jackson were prepared to admit to being the Massapequa Mangler? Now he's making him take the fall because he sucks. For my co -defendant. Ten years eligible for parole in five. And you walk away with what? A ticket for littering? Aiding and abetting? Five years in a minimum security prison where I am allowed to continue to manage investment funds for clients. Is this a challenge? Yeah, yeah. All right. I, 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 no fucking deal. Take my advice and spend some of that money of yours on a lawyer. A real lawyer, not your shit yin yang nonsense. That was different font. Okay, uh, no expert knowledge. Uh, Why don't you get another post it note there, expertise. dude? Expertise. Uh, okay, expert. Okay. <clears throat> and then ask and answer is repeating question really for dramatic effect. Okay. Mr. Jackson. When did you begin working on my estate in Brookfield? About nine months ago. Hold it! Around the time the first of the Mangler's victims was found. 
Uh, yeah, I guess. Earlier, the technology uh. speculated that we formed a dominant submissive parent with you as the submissive. Could he be correct? Could he be correct? Objection. Could he be correct? No expert knowledge. Why would it be no expert knowledge? He doesn't have any ex expert knowledge on the on that kind of pairing. That's no, it's asked and answered. Because he just talked about that, so. The question has been asked and answered. Objection. Damn it! Oh! I hate this! I hate this! He wouldn't have any expert knowledge on that! I hate this, man! Because that is profiling. <sighs> Why do you hate it? Because you don't understand it? So many people with so much access to so much evidence. It would be very hard to say definitively who did what, wouldn't it? Objection, Your Honor. It would be hard to say. No expert. That's got to be no expert knowledge. No, wait, that was hearsay, wasn't it? God damn it! Oh no, we're gonna, we're gonna lose, man. Well, you just keep clicking away at we're gonna, shit. We're gonna fucking lose. And whose fault would that be? Oh, we gotta, we gotta turn it around. We can't. And you really have no idea how fibers from those sacks got on poor Miss Crane? You really have no idea? That That is asked an answer. That has to be. That has to be it. Thank you. Give me that at least. What about the cutting tool, Patrick? The one found in the shed. It had Wendy Crane's blood on it. I don't know. Maybe someone was doing stuff in the shed, like at night. I didn't see it. Well, I would have called the police. You have to admit it is uh, against the two of us, really. I mean, it was my shed. Uh, guess so. You guess so. How did a bloody knife get into my shed without you noticing a thing? I don't know. What's he doing now? He's badgering him. Objection, Your Honor. Okay, no it would be asked to answer then, because I'm pretty sure he just asked him the same question Maybe twice. Maybe he's argumentative. Yeah. Argumentative. Yeah! Down by 30. God! We gotta turn- Stop fucking- No, no, no! You stop fucking we, up! We gotta turn it around! Turn it around! I'm- Ooh, I've told okay. the same twice. Garden shed. Let's- let's- let's start with that. The cutting tool we found in the garden shed, the one with Wendy Crane's blood on it? I suppose you don't know how that got there either. No. What about the fiber no. from Wendy Crane's hair? The ones from the burlap sacks of atrazine in the shed, ones you put there. I didn't bring anyone back there, okay? It could have been him, you know. Can I prove it was not Gandapur? Sure. What? No! What? What? How could you prove it? I can prove that he did it too! God damn it. Blood can you prove that Gandapur did not ah, do it? Blood in the van, okay. Ah. I don't know. Was Wendy Crane ever in your van? No. Jackson lying? Yeah. Yes, because her, her, her shit's in there. Yeah, I got that one at least. Why is the jury taking their side? Just because I got a few things wrong? Yeah! Bullshit. A few things? Bullshit. Like four things so far? Uh, is this it? Or is this it? That was it. Yes! Okay. I hate the fact that if I get one right, I get 10 points, and if I get one wrong, I lose 20. That's nonsense. Well, that's ridiculous. That's not true. I they made you say that. Did they put her blood in your van, too? I don't know how it got there, but it wasn't me. I did it. Your co-counsel has been strangely quiet, Patty. Even you have to know he could have objected a dozen times to what I've had to say so far. Why aren't you trying to stop her? She's badging you, right? Yeah, Mr. that's that's what the tutorial balloon said, right? All for the murders of these eight women. Uh, I guess Mr. Gondopur go free. Objection, Your Honor. Oh, there we go. Jackson doesn't know that. It's conjecture. The same. So you found your voice after all, counsel. 
No more questions, Your Honor. He's obviously trying to make him take the fall. And we're still down by 30. <sighs> Hmm. 